Hey guys, Ben Funnerberg. I'm in Cherokee, North Carolina. We trout fish, and this is a, a second episode of Cherokee Fishing Tips. So stay tuned. <laughs> Okay guys, let me give you a, a little bit of a tip on this fishing in Cherokee. Now I'm fishing in the fall. But when that fishing gets tough, you got to go to these places where these fish are held up that nobody else wants to go to. In other words, if it's hard to get to that spot, there's probably gonna be some fish in there. There he is. They got one. They on the edge over there. They on the edge of the. I got one. Yeah, they over on that edge. Ooh, that's a good one too, buddy. Right down there on that edge, that very edge of that bridge, straight down there, in that little pool, you hit it. There he is. There he is. All right, come on. Ah, uh, horse in him. There you go. Hey, come up here. Come up here, they all stacked up in here. Come on, buddy.
we in this is november and up here in cherokee the, the temperature has been pretty low this morning we had a canadian cold front that moved down here uh earlier in the week so temperatures have been in the 20s in the morning and warming up to about 50 in the in the day midday um and we have uh caught some trout it's been slow going they uh here's your tip you know on uh, these bridges of course if you see uh bridges are wet the uh, railing that's a good sign that they throw them in but you know that's going to dry up and leave no trace where they put them in it but what you can do is walk that bridge and you can see the trout down in the water so just you know come up on your bridge go in there and just look and you'll see trout stacked up down there and then you of course you want to get in there and knock them out and fish it okay guys here's another thing you can do you can download an app called the river app and you can add this river connor lofty i think i'm pronouncing that right and it'll give you the flow rate on that river to keep it feet per second as well as um uh, the how what the how high it is and like this is showing currently uh, 123 cubic feet per second at 1.05 foot i like it to be about 1.5 one and a half foot uh that's a good height i think uh and then if it's the flow rates around 500 or a little bit more than that um uh, uh, cubic feet per second is uh, a great flow rate in my opinion so look at the app might be something you want to download okay guys let me just tell you about under that bridge where uh i was catching a couple of those uh fish um and i ended up catching quite a bit but uh if you look at this when they dumped those fish in the water they were all concentrated right down below this uh piling up under the up under the bridge and one little general area now i had two other buddies fishing with me he was fishing one was down blow stream one was at that second pile and, and then i was out here on this first one they pour those fish in when they grab get a net full of them and they drop them off into the water them fish will stay concentrated in one little general area for a long time so you can really you can limit out quickly um if you if you catch them at the right time this this concludes the uh information on this second trip out to cherokee uh on these tips for this episode if i can uh answer any questions put them in the comments but please like and subscribe if you like this kind of content until the next time god bless all of you and we'll see you later